Hi guys, this is Steve with another premium product overview. Today we're going to cover our valve and seat line. We've got a few variations and a couple different styles to talk about, so please take a look. Alright guys, a couple of variations to cover here. Uh, so first we've got the full open design and the four web design. The four web design has been around a long, long time. Uh, it's paired with a stem guided valve. Uh, the full open is a little more prevalent today. It's a little easier to pull with the extra demand we're putting on things. Uh, and then it's also, uh, it's going to have a little less, you know, restriction here in the middle, obviously. So a little bit better flow. Uh, also, some of the innovations that have been made with uh, some of the pullers and everything, some of these high-tech pullers, uh, they're going to be based around the full open design, not the four web. Now, this one's paired with a wing guided valve. And one thing to point out, you'll notice the premium, premium seats, we like to make these flat on the bottom. Uh, what that does is when you drop this seat in, you can check the distance between the bottom of the seat and the seat deck. It's called the standoff. So we can actually get an idea of what the standoff is and kind of gauge our wear in the seat deck area. Some designs you'll see have an extra longer sleeve that kind of extends from the inside and it limits you from being able to check that standoff. So that's something to think about if you're into that preventative maintenance, which I highly recommend. Uh, it's something that, you know, uh, this kind of design is going to make it really easy to check that kind of stuff. Now there's a couple of taper designs I want to point out. This is what we call the standard taper with this lip. And this here with no lip, this is what we call the modified taper. Uh, that just has to do with the specific fit that your module is going to call for. Now we'll start with the standard service line. This one's designed for your easy drilling conditions. So low temperatures, low solids, good clean mud. Uh, if you find yourself in a situation where all those conditions are fairly benign, but maybe the temperature, maybe just because of the ambient temperature, is creeping up and we need something high temp, we have the blue flame for you. Uh, this one is our lowest cost high temp option. Uh, it's a great choice in those situations to get you through the high temp sections and get back to something that we can get this low cost valve back in the pumps. Now if you find yourself in some more moderate conditions that you might see on a more daily basis, the Patriot VXT might be the choice for you. Uh, we created this one with budget in mind, but since we gave it the Patriot name, it's got to be a great valve. So it's bonded as opposed to a press fit. And I'll point that out real quick. So the press fit, we manufacture the body separately from the urethane, then we press the urethane insert on. That leaves you susceptible to solids and LCM getting into, hit, into this groove and separating the urethane from the body causing failures. With a bonded valve, we take the body, we put it into the mold, and this is actually poured in place with a high temp, heavy duty adhesive to make sure that we get the best bonding uh, possible between the urethane and the body. That's going to give you more resistance to some of those high solid situations. Now if you step into some more demanding conditions, the caliber might be a good choice for you. Uh, this is our all around performer. This is our top selling valve. Uh, it's made for the same X400 material as our X400 piston. It's made for water based, oil based, high temperatures, high solids. It's a bonded valve. Uh, the four web is as well. Uh, so it's going to give you a little more resistance to those high solids and some of that LCM. Uh, it's a good 300 degree temperature rating. So it's again, it's a good all around performer from uh, spud to TD. I mean, you can run this in all those conditions with a lot of headroom. So when you run into some tough sections, this one's going to hold up better than most of the others. Now, if you find yourself in some of those really crazy extreme conditions, the Patriot HT is what we'll recommend. This is our highest performing urethane. It's going to give you the best resistance to solids. It's a bonded valve as well. 300 degree temperature rating and this one performs remarkably well in those really really high temperatures. Now since the conditions you face on a daily basis from well to well from region to region are going to change we've created a line of valves so that you have options to pick the best value for you in each of the conditions you're going to face. Thanks for taking a look. See you next time.